Get set. Switch sculptures, please. Shane, you're a fucking genius. Hello people, this is Ethan H. Minsker from the Antagonist Art Movement. Today we are going to investigate the underground world of the art handler. Art handlers are the guys who set up, and women, who set up every show in New York City, whether it's a museum, gallery, any kind of exhibit you would see, they set it up and break it down. Today, the events we are going to cover are part of the Art Handlers Olympics. Every art handler in the city, when they're working on a job, sits there and thinks about how ridiculous it might be to deal with the stresses and hassles of hanging art. Herculean effort in putting up art and taking it down on a monthly, weekly, and daily basis. I'm the head organizer of today's event, the Art Hand Olympics. It's been something that's been talked about for decades, uh, joked around about. Two years ago, I just thought, like, well, what would it be like if we actually did it? What would the events be? What would what would it look like, what would it feel like, how would it go down, and got lots of crazy drawings in my sketchbook of big grandiose like stage ideas and all that stuff. I said we're going to find out who the best of the best is of a bunch of people you never heard of. The first event is Special Delivery, which is the qualifier race, and it's a homage to all the people, the men and women that slave in, in trucks, maniacally, you know, driving through New York, dealing with just like the worst the weather and the worst of you know conditions and, and, and above and we wanted to have a truck route. Two heats of six teams, two people in a C-bin and the other two uh, members of their team pushing them in the C-bin on a dolly. A C-bin's a commercial bin, it's just, it's just a big old crate box that we use all the time. To make a couple stops, slam some dumplings and some shots because our handlers always eat on the run and they had, the whole point of the thing is to make a delivery, to pick up from a, from a gallery and bring it right back. How's it hanging? How's it hanging is just basically we, we pitted two teams against each other in a battle to hang two pieces with less than ideal conditions. Everything was sabotaged on the back of the frame and they couldn't use a level and uh, you know every day there's always cards stacked against us and everything that we do and we always have to like just figure it out. Pack it in, trying to make a box out of the most unbox making friendly piece of art that you could imagine. Static Hold. Static Hold was a real crowd pleaser. Uh, we had lead sheets, custom made. Gavin Kenyon made us lead sheets. Reed from Hope Frames made us custom frames for them. And they probably, they weigh between 40 to 50 pounds. And that lasted 10 minutes. Very, very, very strong guys holding out. And it was a real crowd pleaser. People were bugging out. <sighs> Higher, 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 hig
there's been a lot of controversy today. Uh, one of the teams was uh, didn't know that we were going to stagger the heat so close together. So they were off watching another heat and they missed the starting point. And then uh, Team Deedle was really pissed off because even though the guy dropped the fucking bees, he claims that he didn't damage it. Which, true, I'll give him that. But in the whole spirit of this thing, you know, we got to make it entertaining for the crowd and all this stuff. So I think in the end, all controversy can be saved until this becomes, uh, you know, a regular institution and the rules become defined and the, the way it runs becomes defined, which is never going to happen. You wouldn't be disqualified. You need to push the painting against the ball. Push the painting against the wall. Our handlers set up the shows and we take them down. Eat that humble pie on a daily basis. Art handlers are the unsung heroes of the art world for sure. This huge uh, community in New York and all over the place, all over the world. Up until stuff like this, we don't really talk about things like using the word community. And, and I kind of felt like we already were, but um, it would be cool if everybody just got together. And it was, it was just love. It was love in this place. It was really, really nice. I got a lot of emails of people asking for West Coast games, for Europe games. People really want to have something in England. We're the lifeblood of the, the art world. We make it all happen. It can be a very absurd job. I'm just amazed that we pulled this off. Yeah, you can go to www. Dot art handling, art handling olympics.com it's kind of a mouthful but um, art handling olympics.com